SAP, or Satisfactory Academic Progress, is a federal policy regarding financial aid eligibility. To find information about this policy, navigate to the Metro State homepage, which is www.mscd.edu. You will see a link for current students in the middle of the page. In the blue box on the left, click on Financial Aid. At the Financial Aid homepage, click on the Keeping Awards button in the yellow bar. You will have to choose Undergraduate or Graduate, and then click on Satisfactory Academic Progress on the left. This will explain all of the SAP policy, will have an explanation of the standings, and will explain the appeal process. Satisfactory academic progress policies require all students receiving federal, state, and or institutional aid to meet and maintain specific academic standards. All forms of financial aid are affected by this policy except for some externally funded scholarships and some private alternative loans. Your academic record, all transfer credits, and all credits attempted while you are not receiving financial aid are subject to the Satisfactory Academic Progress Policy. Your academic progress will be evaluated at the end of each semester during which you attend school, and it will be reviewed before any disbursement of financial aid funds for a new semester. Remedial hours are not included in the overall 180 credit limit. There are four categories that your academic progress may fall into. The first is good standing. You are considered to be in good standing during the first 130 credit hours of coursework you attempt by maintaining a cumulative grade point average of at least 2.0, by maintaining a cumulative completion rate of 75% or higher, and by having less than 130 total cumulative attempted hours. The next is alert standing. You will be placed on alert standing, which will not affect your financial aid disbursement if you have completed at least 67% of the credit hours you have attempted, but your pace of progression is less than 75%. You have attempted between 130 and 180 cumulative credit hours, including transfer credits, or if you have not completed between 36 and 60 of the credits you have attempted. Warning Standing You will be placed on warning if you fall into the SAP criteria immediately following a semester during which you were in alert or good standing. Warning does not affect your financial aid disbursement. You will generally have one semester to improve your standing back to good or alert. If you are unable to do so after one semester, you will be placed on SAP. SAP Standing You will be placed on SAP and will not be eligible to receive financial aid at Metro State for one or more of the following reasons. Your cumulative GPA is below 2.0. You do not attain a 2.0 cumulative GPA after one semester on warning. You fail to complete at least two-thirds, or 67%, of the total number of credit hours you have attempted, or you complete 0% of the attempted credits during a semester. Students will not be offered financial aid if they have attempted 180 or more credits or if they are mathematically unable to graduate within the 180 credit limit. If you are placed on financial aid SAP, you have the right to submit a written appeal to our office. Appeals must be based on extenuating circumstances that prevent you from meeting the requirements of this policy. Extenuating circumstances can be defined as medical problems, a death in the immediate family, and or extreme personal problems. Documentation of these circumstances must be submitted with the appeal. The appeal must also explain why the circumstances no longer exist and what you will do to ensure meeting the satisfactory academic progress policy in the future. You can obtain an appeal form from the Office of Financial Aid or you may do an online appeal. The appeal will be reviewed by a financial aid counselor. You will be notified in writing the result of the appeal if that appeal is denied, you may submit additional documentation in writing to the Professional Judgment Committee. If your appeal requires you to turn in additional documentation, you must do so either by fax or by turning it into the front desk. If you have an appeal approved, you will be placed under financial aid probation for one semester. 
If you continue to complete 100% of your attempted credits with a term GPA of at least 2.25 during a semester on probation, you will not need to submit an appeal in order to receive financial aid for the following semester unless you have reached the overall 180 attempted credit limit. To find your satisfactory academic progress standing online, you can do so through your Metro Connect. First, navigate to the Metro State homepage, and in the upper right hand corner, you will see a link for Metro Connect. From the main page, you will click on the tab My Services and Registration. Once again, you'll click on the link for My Services and Registration. And from here, you'll click on the first link that will take you to the financial aid menu. And then on the fourth link, entitled Financial Aid. Here you will click on the first link for My Overall Status of Financial Aid. You will have to select your aid year. And here you will see a link for Academic Progress. Inside this link, it will show a record of your Academic Progress standing currently as well as in previous semesters at Metro. As always, remember to check your Metro State email because it is the official means of communication from the Office of Financial Aid.